Ever see a male infertility case where the sperm count and motility are normal but conception still fails? The problem might be a single critical step, the acrosome reaction. Ever see a male infertility case where the sperm count and motility are normal but conception still fails? The problem might be a single critical step, the acrosome reaction. After a long journey to the ampulla of the fallopian tube, the sperm finally meets the secondary oocyte, but it is locked out by a glycoprotein fortress, the zona pellucida. To get in the sperm's acrosome must release powerful enzymes like acrosin digesting a path through this barrier. This is the acrosome reaction. A defect here means fertilization is impossible, a key cause of male infertility. Once one sperm gets through the oocyte slams the door shut. It undergoes the cortical reaction, releasing granules that harden the zona pellucida, preventing polyspermy, a lethal condition. With the fusion of pronuclei, we now have a diploid zygote. This single cell immediately begins cleavage dividing as it travels towards the uterus, marking the very first chapter of human development. Like, share, and subscribe, White Coat Minutes.